APD is still not saying if a man police shot yesterday in Northeast Albuquerque had a gun. But one witness says not only did the suspect have a gun, he shot at police first. Albuquerque police got a call just before two yesterday afternoon about a domestic dispute. A woman afraid of her ex-boyfriend. News 13 has learned seven minutes after that call came in, officers were warned about the suspect's criminal history, which includes at least 12 felony warrants for his arrest. Officers caught up with him on Wyoming north of Indian School, right near a busy shopping center. One woman driving in the area who asked to remain anonymous witnessed what happened next. They're yelling back and forth. This guy's on sidewalk, the cops in behind the door of his car, and and all of a sudden, this guy pulls out a gun and aims it right at the cop. She says after the suspect pulled out a gun, the cop did too. She says the officer was yelling something at the suspect before the suspect fired the first shot. All of a sudden, he starts shooting at the cop. When well, the cops start shooting back, and then four or five other police cars show up, the light turned green, and I took off, and I could hear the shots, and I looked in my rearview mirror, and I saw them chasing him. News 13 has learned the suspect wasn't following orders from police and instead was challenging officers to shoot him when he reached to the back of his waistband for what witnesses say was a gun. Chief Allen Banks said yesterday multiple officers shot at the suspect. He was taken to the hospital with injuries, including a gunshot wound to the leg. Police have just released the suspect's name. He is 34-year-old Shane Sherrill. They said yesterday he went to the hospital in critical condition and they haven't said how he's doing today.